हेलो कोडर्स वेलकम टू डेव बाइट स्कूल डेट इन सेशन ऑफ मास्टरिंग स्प्रिंग बूट सो इन दिस सेशन वी फोकसिंग ऑन राइटिंग अ टेस्ट केसेस ओके सो फॉर राइटिंग अ टेस्ट केसेस वी आर यूजिंग यूजिंग जेमिट फाइव एंड मॉकिटो ओके सो आई गो स्टेप बाय स्टेप टू एक्सप्लेन यू द होल प्रोसेस ओके आई ऑलरेडी डिड अ कोड चेंजेस टू सेव अवर टाइम ओके सो फर्स्ट वी नीड टू एड अ डिपेंडेंसी Uh, in a pom file which is spring boot starter dot test okay so when you add a spring boot starter dependency a uh, test one so whatever dependency required is is download like it's automatically download jmunit 5 for us the automatic download uh, mockito for us so we don't need to take care uh, uh, all dependencies uh, spring starter will be take care of that okay so after adding the de uh, dependency uh, in a uh, block controller in update block service Uh, we have uh, overall three uh, scenarios okay so first scenario is that whenever uh, any validation issue occur means for example is uh, whatever validate parameter we have if uh, user not pass this parameter we throwing some exception so we need to take care this scenario uh, second scenario we have if uh, whatever uh, user uh, uh, particular updating that block and that block is not present in a database we are uh, throwing the exception record not found okay and the last scenario is a success scenario where we are saving operation uh, saving a blog in a database okay and uh, uh, if it is uh, saved successfully we return a success response okay so we are covering the, uh, all these three scenarios okay so it is required uh, to write a test driven uh, development because uh, if you write a test driven development and when you push that code uh, to a production there there are like 98% probability like all codes working fine and minimal issue occur okay so let's jump to our uh, test class okay so i create a, a block controller test okay i i show you the package structure okay so here src uh, main uh, in src okay main and uh, in the parallel we have a uh, test folder okay so in test folder i create one uh, uh, package which is controller and in that controller i create a block controller okay so basically we are uh, testing our re uh, rest endpoint okay you can test uh, your uh, service logic also if you want okay so i will uh, step by step explain the whole annotation which we using okay so first important annotation is extend with okay so extend uh, with basically we extending some functionality here we are using a mockito extension so mockito extension basically uh, add all feature of uh, junit 5 and mockito like uh, enable all required feature for testing okay then we are using web mvc uh, test annotation and in web test annotation we are using like uh, giving value as a block controller so it this annotation used for testing uh, restful web services okay then uh, this mock mvc object we required to mocking the stuff after that uh, we are using object mapper like we are uh, sending a request body to convert uh, to a uh, string and all the stuff we required that after that we uh, mocking the block service so that reason we are using a uh, mock bin annotation so basically in a uh, testing uh, we are not calling actual uh, flow for example we uh, perform a find by user id operation okay or we are performing save operation so we are not do, uh, doing a save and find by operation and connect with database we are mocking that okay i will explain that okay so first uh, method i, I return like uh, test update block validation failed okay so here i create a uh, object of update block request in that ob object block request i'm passing a block id as a empty okay so if we passing a block id as a empty we expect it's fail with bad request and the message will be written is block id requ uh, required parameter okay so here uh, basically i calling uh, i using like mock mvc uh, request builder and uh, pass this uh, our api path and our method is a put method okay and the request body is application json and output is also application json so whatever uh, object we prepare we passing there okay and after passing we taking uh, the response okay 
सो इन दिस रिस्पॉन्स वी एक्सपेक्ट लाइक बैड रिक्वेस्ट फोर हंड्रेड स्टेटस कोड एंड रिस्पॉन्स वी एक्सपेक्ट इज लाइक दिस मैसेज वी एक्सपेक्ट लाइक ब्लॉग आई डी इज रिक्वायर्ड पैरामीटर ओके आफ्टर दैट नेक्स्ट टेस्ट केस इज टेस्ट अपडेट ब्लॉग रिकॉर्ड नॉट फाउंड ओके सो इन रिकॉर्ड नॉट फाउंड वॉट आई एम डेड ओके आई आई मॉक माई सर्विस लेयर ओके सो हियर वट आई एम सेंग इफ एनी अपडेट ब्लॉक रिक्वेस्ट इज कमिंग जस्ट रिटर्न नल सो इन द अवर सीनारियो बेसिकली अवर सर्विस a uh, method returning null and with the, with respect to that uh, we are throwing a, a record not found exception so that reason i am returning that so here it will be return a record not found expect, uh, exception and the status code we are expecting is uh, not found and the message we are expecting is record not present database okay after that in a success scenario okay basically uh, um, uh, basically in success scenario we passing this uh, uh, request object okay and uh, the block object uh, i create okay so when a service method call okay i'm expecting it will be return a save object to us okay so if the service uh, layer return a save object to us we will uh, give a status code as a okay okay so here i expect uh, only status code as a okay okay so this uh, three test case uh, we are returning okay i will show you controller also so here like um, if object is uh, come as null we throwing a record not found exception this is for a validation okay and final is a success here we showing as a success okay so let's run our uh, test cases okay and see what output is coming okay so i run this test cases okay it's running cool our all test cases pass successfully okay yeah that's it from today's video uh, if you still have any question please write down in comment we will try to address that and i will push all code to our github repository you can refer from there okay and in next uh, coming videos uh, we are uh, implement caching functionality using redis and uh, caffeine cache two level cache and after that we deploy our application to a production okay so if you like our video give us thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and let's meet on our next uh, session till then happy coding